March 28th. Isn't there some misunderstanding? Let us go into Judea, his disciples said unto him. Goest thou thither again? John 11, 7 through 8. I may not understand what Jesus Christ says, but it is dangerous to say that therefore he was mistaken in what he said. It is never right to think that my obedience to a word of God will bring dishonor to Jesus. The only thing that will bring dishonor is not obeying him. To put my view of his honor in place of what he is plainly impelling me to do is never right, although it may arise from a real desire to prevent him from being put to shame. I know when the proposition comes from God because of its quiet persistence. When I have to weigh the pros and cons, and doubt and debate come in, I am bringing in an element that is not of God, and I come to the conclusion that the suggestion was not a right one. Many of us are loyal to our notions of Jesus Christ, but how many of us are loyal to Him? Loyalty to Jesus means I have to step out where I do not see anything, refer to Matthew 14.29. Loyalty to my notions means that I clear the ground first by my intelligence. Faith is not intelligent understanding. Faith is deliberate commitment to a person where I see no way. Are you debating whether to take a step in faith in Jesus or to wait until you can see how to do the thing yourself? Or to wait until you can see how to do the thing yourself? Obey him with glad, reckless joy. When he says something and you begin to debate, it is because you have a conception of his honor which is not his honor. Are you loyal to Jesus or loyal to your notion of him? Are you loyal to what he says, or are you trying to compromise with conceptions which never came from him? Whatsoever he saith unto you, do it.